Praise be to God. Father, we come on today, God. We ask of you, Lord, that you would please remove self, God. Father, speak through me. Speak for me. Speak to your people, God. Tell your people what you would have them to know. Father, I thank you right now for what you're going to do with this place. Father, I thank you for the word, dear God. And I ask right now, dear God, that it will lift up a bow down here. Father, that it would save somebody on today. Father, that they would figure it out that you are the only true and living God. Father, we thank you right now, God. Move in this house. Father, do it right now. We ask this all in the precious name of Jesus, who are my Lord. Thank God. Thank God. Amen. 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 You may be seated. I do realize that we get programs every week, and in the program, they don't have my name to read. <laughs> so that means that this was pretty uh, spare at the moment. I really don't have like a Mother's Day message, but I believe that this message, if, if, you, if you get into it, that it can help every mother, every man, Every girl and every boy. Yeah. We ask that that's what this word does. So yeah. I apologize to you, mothers. It is going to be said, I'm going to say something, but I just want you to know I, I, I didn't have that in time, but we thank God for what He's done. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm coming out of Psalm 124. I'm going to read. First, second, third, and the eighth verse. All right. It reads, If it had not been the Lord who was on our side, now may Israel say, If it had not been the Lord who was on our side. When men rose up against us, then they had swallowed us up quick when their wrath was kindled against us. Go down to 8 verse, it says, Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. That the scripture I want to preach on. If no help, then what? If no help, then what? Uh, could you imagine? I'm here to tell you 
Each one I just named off, I done used already. <laughs> I done used them more than once, each one of them. Wow. And I could only think if it wasn't there at the time that I needed them, then what? Uh -huh. Well. What then? Yeah. In this lifetime, we have to realize that in some way, some form, some fashion, uh -huh. we need something or somebody help. Yeah. Uh, even the unbeliever yeah. or the backslider yeah. is looking for him. Yeah. Uh, they say they're looking in the wrong places. Some are looking in the bottom well. for him. Some are looking for, for drugs to help them. Yeah. Uh, it's pretty bad times when you have to get high to make your day go smooth. That's the wrong kind of help. I'm here to tell you today that Jesus is our help. Uh, he left with us when he left a comforter and the Holy Spirit to live inside of us. And that is our help in the Christian world. Just want to say a few verses that meant so much to me. Wow. Psalms 33 and 20 reads, are so waiting for the Lord. Mm -hmm. He is our help yes. and our shield. Yes. yes. Oh, that means something. All right. That really means something to me. And, and, and then I went on to see 40, Psalms 46 and 1 and said, God is our refuge yeah. and strength our very present help in trouble. All right, all right. Then I went on, I said, Psalms 121, I will lift up my eye unto the hills yeah. from which cometh my help. Yeah. My help cometh from the Lord. Again, it says, the Lord who made heaven and earth. All right, now. Those uh, scriptures help me sometimes when I'm driving along. It comes to my mind. The Lord is my shield. Yes, yes. yes. The Lord is my help. Yes, yes, he is. He went on to say he's the ever present help. He's faster than any policeman, yeah. any bullet. Yeah. He's the man that you need at all times all right. Amen. Amen. to be your help. Yeah. I'm here to tell you today that God, God that we serve, yeah. Yeah. is a good God. Yes, and he will help you all right. in the time of need. There was time when I didn't know I had the help. All right. It was there all along. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes. Some of us can, 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 uh, can sort of come in with me and, and agree with me that the help has always been there. All right. But it took a long time to get it. But I thank God today All right. that I know where my help comes from. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And I thank God today that I don't have to worry about anything or anybody. Yes. Wow. Yes. Because I have the help All right. of the Lord. Yeah. All right. See, some 
times we messed up help. Mm. There was a time, mothers, when you had your children mm -hmm. and everybody was responsible for them. Well, well. Yeah. It wasn't just the parent. It seemed like the whole community yeah. was watching your child. But then, some parents say, they ain't gonna do my child like that. They ain't gonna do it. They will not lay a hand on my child. They won't talk to my child any kind of way. We messed up our health. Can't you see the streets now are so messed up because you think you know it all? to go back sometimes and, and ask for our help again. All right. This is vital times, scary times, because people have lost respect well, well. for one another. Yeah. Uh, the pastor said it today, people don't even say hi to one another no more. They got attitudes. Their faces all mug. I know I, I drive city transit and every day I look at these people and they look like zombies and there's something wrong with them. And I get on there and say, how you doing, sir? They don't say a word. They walk and stand. How can you have somebody talk to you when you not talk back? Wow. We living in some messed up time. Yeah. They 
drinking if you didn't have the Lord on your side. I believe that we have to trust and depend on Jesus. Yeah, yeah. In every situation. Yeah. Every situation. Mothers, we have to train up our child yeah. the way they should go. That scripture. Well, well. Uh, we should do it. Repeatedly bring them. If they're not able to drive off on Sunday morning, you ought to bring them to uh -oh. church because yeah. this is the real help. Yeah. Yeah. This is the help that's going to mean something in life and death situations. Yeah. Amen. God is a good God. Man. But he needs the invitation in your life to be that help for you. Yeah. I was sitting around just thinking. Lord, I work in the psych hospital. Brian, uh, eight years. Kids. And I said to myself, I got to get away from here. <laughs> I love these kids, but this is driving me crazy. No. So I went over to the Metro. Now I got old kids. <laughs> <laughs> they, they was right there, waiting on me. I was so surprised. I was so used to driving people around and getting tips and courtesy, thank you, and all that. I didn't know that I was going to get cussed out on a daily basis. I didn't know that I, if I told them they had to pay $1.50, they wanted to go upside my head. I didn't know that. That ain't what I signed up for. All I wanted to do was try. Get them to point A to point B. But God knows where to put me. And where to use me. Oh, yeah. And I invite people. I say, you want to come over down to my church? Third missionary now. Ask them to come. Come on and see about it. We have had some that showed up. But I'm here to tell you today, we all need to do that. Yeah, yeah. We need to start inviting people back into God's house. Yeah. If they're your friend and you want to see them make it, you got to bring them to the Lord's side. Yeah. So I declare yeah. that I need God in my life all the time. Yeah. I pray all day long. I didn't never know that I could pray all day. I can just see him walking. Lord, touch him. Lord, heal him. Lord, fix him. Lord, do this. Lord, do that. Lord, fix the drug. Lord, help him. Lord, touch. Lord, all day long. Thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. That I'm able to say, Lord, touch his life. Bring him back to where he used to be. Now I know, I apologize, this is not the message that we was looking for today. Well, but, it's on time, it's on time. Thank you, Lord. But God is good. Yes. 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 And his mercy endures forever. Yes. Yeah. I look to the hills for which come my help. Yes. Yeah. My help. Come from the Lord. The one. The one. Hey, heaven. Heaven and earth. Yeah. 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 There needs to be that time. God wants us 
to the pit of your head. Yeah. Yeah. Just like our children, they know if they're hungry, you're going to feed them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They know if they're thirsty, you're going to get them something to drink. Uh, they know no. if they get hurt, you're going to see them out. Mm -hmm. I'll never forget when I was young. Play rough. Fall. I run in mama, grandma, scarred up. Maybe a bruise or something. And they say, baby, just let me kiss you. And everything is going to be all right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm hurting over here. <laughs> <laughs> but something, something in the kiss. Yeah. It worked. Yeah. All right. It, it didn't hurt as bad. No. Uh, uh, something we do. We have to know that we it's gonna be all right at the end of the day. Yeah. And that's what the Lord wants us to know. Yeah. He wants us to know that whatever we're going through, yeah. Yeah. if you just bring it to him, yeah. it's gonna be all right. It might not shape up like this and like that. See, we want, we, 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 we have changed. We want stuff right now. We want a car, we want it right now. Mm -hmm. We want to plan for it. <coughs> we want a house, we want it right now. But things don't go that way in That's this right. world. God knows what's best for us. Yeah. And if he's on our side, you just have to rest right there. Yes. Right. You just have to rest right there. I don't care what it is. You just rest right there. That whatever's going on around you, Lord, it's going to be all right. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Because it's, it's yours. I'm giving this burden to you. He wants it. Mm -hmm. He wants to show you who he is. Oh, oh just like when Israel marched around in the fall, I can just imagine that it's just probably, I don't know why they, the Lord had to march around in the fall all them times, but it was probably just to show them that they couldn't do that, they couldn't get in. Wow. But, on that seventh day, yeah. they marched and marched and the walls came tumbling down. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. He wanted to show them that you can't do it. I have to do it for you. All right, all right. If you got a sickness, you can't heal yourself. Well, he has to heal yeah, you. Yeah. If you have a problem in your life, you can't fix it. He has to fix it. Yeah. You'll be driving yourself crazy. Trying to fix it yourself. Lord says, give it to me. I'll take it. I'll make it better for you. But you have to trust me. Amen. So whatever's going on, rest right there. Yeah. Baby, it's going to be all right. Oh, yeah. yes, yes. Remember that. When times is rough, yeah. baby, it's going to be all right. A 
way to tell you we serve that God. Oh, yeah. That whatever you're going through, Amen. baby, it's going to be all right. Yeah. Hallelujah. Lord knows. If I was doing that, we can rest in it because this is the God that did what? Made heaven and earth. Yes. Surely, if he made heaven and earth, he can fix our troubles. All right. He can fix our problems. Yeah, yeah. See, we try to just keep on doing stuff that we know how to do. That lady with the issue of blood, she tried all kinds of stuff. Yeah. She wasted all kinds of money. Mm. But her help came walking by one day. Yes. And she said, oh, if I could just touch the hem of his garment. Yeah. Oh, come on, somebody. Who knows that God has all power yes, in his hands? Yeah. He has all power yeah. in his hands. So, 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 baby, it's going to be all right. She wanted to just touch the hem of his garment. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. She made her way. Yeah. And she touched. The Lord, Lord, see who touched me. And he healed her right there. Yeah. It's our faith, God. Yes, yes. Where does your faith lie in God? Do you just know he can and don't think to use him for what? He can do all things.
put our churches be on fire if we have no help from the Lord? Uh, would they be sound doctor in the church that you go to if there's no help from the Lord? No. We need to quit trying to find the mega church that can't, that's not teaching you anything. They give you an inspirational message and they send you on their way. And you be so happy until later that day. Something will come up and you go all messed up again. Hmm. But Jesus is our help. So even if you're not at the church house, you should be able to count on you. So you need this God that I'm talking about. You need him in your life. Yeah. Uh, if it had not been for the Lord on our side, right, right. where would we be? God knows. Just the thought. Just the thought is scary. Because I don't know who all knows that the Lord is on their side. Amen. Is there anybody in here today that truly knows that the Lord Amen. is on your side? Oh, yes. And if you know he's on your side, you know, baby, it's going to be all right. So when you walk down that third road, and there's nothing there. But then you turn around and these pack of dogs is coming at you. God will show up. Yes, he will. He will show up. Yes, he will. Somebody ought to just thank you for knowing that the Lord is on their side. The Lord just say, Lord, thank you. For being on my side. Look at your neighbor and say, Lord, I thank you for being on my side. For every situation that I go through, Lord, you're right there. I can't go here without you being there. I can't go there without you being there. Lord, I thank you for being on my side. I thank you every day that I go through seeing all these people crazy and deranged. Lord, I thank you. For being on my side. Yeah. Maybe it's going to be all right. Yeah. It's going to be all right, I tell you. Yeah. With Jesus Christ Thank on your side. Yeah. Thank you right now.